Let's talk about my favorite command in the Old Testament. It's my favorite because it's always misinterpreted. When you read it in plain English without studying the entire context, it looks really bad. But when you study it out, it's really good. Deuteronomy 28. When a man finds a girl who is a maiden who is not engaged and he seizes her and lies with her and they are found out, then the man who lay with her shall give the girl's father 50 pieces of silver and she is to be his wife because he has humbled her. He is not allowed to put her away or divorce her for all of his days. Most people who have never studied Torah or have any understanding of these types of scriptures think this verse is about but it's not. It's about seducing the young lady and taking advantage of her and not asking her father's permission for her hand and doing things in the proper way. So for fun, I calculated how much 50 shekels of silver is in today's prices. 50 shekels of silver is 19.4 ounces, which works out to about uh, $492 at today's silver rate. I thought that was really interesting. It's not a ton of money, but in that time, it would have been enough to be a deterrent. But the other more important deterrent is he knew we would have to marry her because all of the community came together to keep these commands because they didn't want to see young women taken advantage of. They didn't want to see young women having players play them. How could we think about this command today? How could this command teach us today? Well, I would say if you see a young maiden and she's happy and having fun and enjoying her life and you don't plan on marrying her and making her life better, and enriching her life and covering her and protecting her, just leave her alone.